today. By the time I quit my job, my daughters were out of high school and into college. And since they had decided that they didn't want to go to an Ivy League college because they wanted to go to school with the brothers and sisters, you know, that was the move then. They had gone to a private school all this time, but now they want to go to City College or, you know, some place where they could be with their peers. And I said, you know, these kids have demonstrated on all these college campuses to open them up for black people. And you, you kids are lined up to go to the top schools. You can go to any Ivy League school in this country. You don't want to go? No. Oh, I'll make up. Michelle, Michelle says, oh, I'll think about it later. I, I can't think about it right now. I said, oh, my God. I said, well, I'll tell you what I do. I'm going to quit my job. That'll settle it. Because <laughs> that's why I was going to keep working. You know, to make sure that life was comfortable for them in these Ivy League schools. Because these kids need a lot of money to do that. Mm -hmm. So I was going to help do that. But since they want to, what do you call it, uh, drop out and, and whatever that was they were doing. But they caught it quickly. And nobody lost any time out of school. They immediately got themselves into, you know, where they were supposed to be and went on with their college educations and got their degrees and everything worked out beautifully for them without my working. Because I did quit my job. 